Hey guys, hopefully you're having a good day. Today I'm going to show you how to play dominoes. And you can also use dominoes as what I did there. Um, the angle was very, very bad because of course I have to hold the camera. But in the end of the video, I want to do this again, but longer and more fun for you guys to watch. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and let's, let's play. First, you have to grab the box of the dominoes. Now, no one knows how to properly play dominoes. They just eat dominoes if you do the step thing. Dominoes is also super loud. We're also going to put dominoes on the floor. Dominoes is supposed to have this squarey thing that so here's what the back of it looks like, but I do remember, I think, how to play this. A little. So you see, guys, if we have a dominoes piece right here, and then let's say it's 7 and 2, which 7 and 5. And you want to go to the bottom at 7, and you at least need the color pink or the number 7, I think, for you to be able to move on. You want to go to the top, you have to find 5. To move on. If you need to go to the top, you need a two. So let's try and see if they are all kind of the same color. So I'm going to try and find every single two to see if they're all different colors. To just see if you just need to play, I am going to be randomly just checking the rule book of it, which is the back of the Domino's box, and it's a little. I love it doesn't have text for some reason. That means I guess you can just put whatever you want, I don't know. So every single number is, every single domino style is flipped over. I'm going to move every single two. And yes, so guys, it is true. So we have one green two, two green twos, three green twos, four green twos, five green twos, six green twos, seven green twos, eight green twos, and nine green twos, green twos, and ten green twos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we actually have ten. So this means every single number is the exact same color with all the other ones. So let's say if we have an 8, 8 is black. Get it. So every single 8 will be that exact same color. So we're going to be building a little field of the numbers. Okay, so it'll take a while. We found nine, these are sixes. At all, I don't know how to play this. Need a seven up there. And now one. Okay, so guys, we have a mini field. Let me just say you guys. So guys, this is what the board game looks like, I think. You see the starting number let number was two and a nine a two and a six. We were going to head up where you have to use a two. Right here, you have to use a 6 to go down into its combo. You can see we're always using 8. 8. You can see. Now this one, you have to use a 6, then a 3, then an 8. See? Whatever the ending number. So let's say there was one 1 right here, and you want it to move right here. Well, you need a 1. Sorry for the camera. I am holding the camera. Now uh, let's say if we find another one, I guess one's right here. You'll just oh, crap. Um, this. 
can just put it right there because there's a one at the top. At the bottom there's eight, and if you want to go to the top, you have to get a seven and four. There's a four right here, and a seven right here. Twos right here, six and eight, threes, and other numbers. You can see it's by the number. It's not by the color. If it's the exact same color, that means it's not going to make sense. I'm using my hand for this because, of course, you can't see my face. So you guys can, of course, see it. You need to get the exact same number. So depending on, hold on. So depending on what you need is you need the exact same number as the exact same game house. I can't see because I'm looking in the camera. So you see, you need the exact same number, not the exact same color. So if you try to play this, like that, that won't work. If you try to play like that, that would work. This one, I drew that. So that's how to play dominoes the actual way, but just remember if you're going to try and play dominoes, you just need to remember that the colors are not the good part. Only the numbers are what's really, really needed. So if you have to move up to the top, that means you need four. You need four right here. You need four right here, and now you need to move on to the different tile. Now let's see if you wanted to move right here. Can you still move here if there's another tile? Well, let's check the back of the box. I don't think that's allowed. Yeah, it's definitely not allowed. It is definitely not allowed. So, let's find another nine or a six or nine, I guess. So boom, that is a nine. You can see this nine right here, that won't count. So there's already a tile right here, you can just say bye bye to that one. You, say, you see, you cannot play a tile that's already here if there's another tile right here. So that means if you ever wanted to move there, you had to move this one right there first. If there's already one right there, that means you can no longer move back here unless if you're trying to go play smart play games. See, that's how you play dominoes. It's actually super, super easy and super fast. If you don't have the manual, that means you are absolutely screwed. If you don't have the manual, that means you cannot know how to play this. Or if you just look at the back of the box, you have a mini instructions book showing what the game is supposed to look like. The camera is not very good because I have to hold it and use my hand to talk to y'all. Because, of course, if I show my face, I'm not able to show you guys what the pieces look like, so it's better to do this with my fingers and hands. But yes, it's time to get to the ending part, guys, but if you remember, dominoes have to play dominoes, is you just need to remember that if you're trying to go anywhere, you have to get the exact same number, just not the color. You need to get the number, and that means that there's a 2 right here, you need another 2. If you put the exact same color, but it's like a 3, then that means you cannot do it just have to remember that the color is what is going to happen by the way it's very weird to use my hand to talk to you guys even though you can hear me um i don't have a microphone because i keep forgetting them my my microphone in every single video i have to do this so guys let's get to the ending part where we go where i'm going to be building a domino line and i'm going to be dropping it and my reaction is actually really funny. And yes, guys, I am going to be putting y'all like there. I'm going to time lapse this so you guys don't have to wait 10 minutes for me to put on. Hey guys, so I'm just gonna show you that this video took a very, very long while to record. It did only take me one day though, but uh, I did this at the Titan Bay. You can hear the rain. You can definitely hear it. It's going through for I don't know how much days. It is very, 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 very wet outside. And you can see I'm currently clearing up the dominoes from this video. This is just another video. And this is added to the domino video. 
Um, you guys will know that this video, <laughs> that video actually, but this video did take one entire hour. One hour or more. Us, the dominoes. In the end of the video, guys, the end of this video, I did a knocking down of domino pieces. What I didn't expect was the dominoes would be very, 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 very hard. For the first part of the video where I did the first knockdown, that part, um, that part, I did not mess up that much. I think I only messed up like once or none. I just had to move the location. That part was easy. But the one mainly to the end was a lot harder because I was messing up so much times. The pieces would not be on my favor. This end part might be a little long, so I might just speed it up. But yes, this video did take me more than an hour. You guys. Hey guys, so this is something I'm working on for a video. This is part of a random video idea that I have where I'm going to work on something. I'm going to time lapse this. So you guys can watch this. Videos might not be happening much on this iPad anymore because it's running low on storage. But hopefully you guys enjoy this. Okay guys, it is it. This, I have changed the design. Because the last one was way too difficult. Are you guys ready? There's more. I'm going to show you guys the end and the U-turn. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Have a great time. Peace. Here we go. Yes! That was awesome! And I have another. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, welcome guys. Today we're going to show you how to play dominoes and have a little fun little dominoes chain. Ah. 